Welcome to the shortwave radio channel, and just to let you know that the uh, famous Texan S2200X that I reviewed is available from Anonco. It is officially on sale this week, so uh, it is available a little earlier than uh, expected. So uh, I know that some of you have uh, already or want to purchase one. Uh, I got somebody that told me today that uh, he was happy that it was already available. So uh, just to let you know that, um, it's, I still love the radio. Uh, you just got to remember its little quirks. Um, I think the, if I have to give it two, the two biggest uh, little flaws would be that the S meter doesn't follow. It has a delay in it. I'm not sure that can be fixed. It depends on where they tap. And because it has a DSP chip, maybe that is the problem with that. It follows the speed of the uh, signal-to-noise signal ratio, basically. Uh, the other thing uh, is just remember that there's a slight instability in the single sideband on upper frequencies around above 20 megahertz, mostly um, at, at you know 11 meters and 10 meter frequencies. The good news, if there is one to have with that, is that that wobble, that instability, is not as bad as other receivers. So it still is, you know, you can still kind of understand uh, well what they're saying. But you'll notice that there's a little trembling in their voice. But um, I've, I've tuned 10 meters, 11 meters quite a few times on it. And... Uh, you know, you notice it, but it's not something that bothers me too much. Uh, in lower frequencies, it's perfect. If you, if, you, if you tune around, like, below 25 megahertz, it's pretty much very, very stable. And it is very good in its frequency accuracy. Once you calibrate it, um, this is better than other Texan receivers because you calibrate it, and you don't really have to calibrate it again. Um, you know, soon. I've I don't think I've calibrated the the radio since I've got it. So it tells you that uh, its frequency uh, precision is very very good, uh, and it is a very big upgrade from the original S2000 uh, Eton 750 and uh, Grundig 750. Uh, it is definitely a big upgrade and much better than the original. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.